2022 Specialized Levo Expert. Got this bike at the bike shop a couple days ago. Thanks again to my buddies, Eric and Grant. Hey, I'm on a mountain and I'm riding a bike. So I'm mountain biking. There's no official trails here or anything like that. I'm just riding on a mountain with my Levo. I got about 28 miles, 26, 28 miles on it so far. And I had about 20 miles on a Levo Pro uh, a couple months ago. So maybe I'm close to 50 miles on the new mullet setup. Boy, I love the mullet. It just feels like a dirt bike. I like the 29er front that floats everything. And I like that smaller, more compact rear end that just handles faster. I, it just feels better on the tight trails. Although I'm still in Pennsylvania uh, goofing off in kind of the wide stuff, but I have gone off trail here on some tight things and I like that agility feel, but it has this crazy combo of like kind of fun to handle and yet it still feels confident at speed. I think the whole thing being slacked out a little bit feels a lot better. I had a Comp Carbon with 219, 2019 with the 29 inch wheels and that bike was really good. This is so much more stable at speed yet still, still more agile and fun to play on so that's what i really like and the more time i get on this the more i realize how much i like the the new geometry and just how it feels it's you know it just kind of feels like it makes me want to go wheelie and just ride like a dirt bike and i'm a moto guy at heart so it feels real natural now again these are just i don't really know what these things are maybe this is like a fire break or something but you don't really see, these aren't prepared trails. But it is up in the mountain, I'm on a mountain bike. And I love the new motor, the tuning is so smooth. It, uh, I turned the acceleration, now I'm up to, I'm trying out 60% uh, acceleration response today. So, that just kind of gives it a little more jumpy, poppy feel as I'm climbing over the rocks and Sometimes I have to do a half pedal. Man, it's a beautiful day in PA. Look at that view. Now here's where this new motor is just so smooth. And it finds traction. It's kind of little tricky climbs. Of course, GoPro makes everything look, look like it's flat. But it isn't. Oh, 700 watt hour battery. I think I already said that. So that means I'm on turbo. I can use turbo all I want. This bike is so quiet. This is real mountain bike riding. Not sure where I'm going. A couple big rocks in here. Hidden in the weeds. Let's see. Guess we'll set this thing up. All right. 2022 Levo Expert. I love those Fox, the Fox suspension. Super adjustable, high and low speed. We got a lot of stuff to play with there. I haven't messed with the steering. You can change those angles. I haven't done the flip chip. It's just in the high setting now, so I guess I can lower it and slacken it out if I want. The 160 cranks are nice, a little more clearance. For pedal strikes so i think honestly this bike is so much fun i'm really i'm really digging the mullet and the stability i have a canevo but i think i'm going to sell that because i can this thing does a little bit of everything it just feels real racy punchy i like to pull wheelies and jump i just it just enjoy riding it so two big thumbs up hopefully we'll get it out more later this week.